Hello friends in this video tutorial we are going to make simple Laravel Live MySQL data search application with sorting and pagination feature using Ajax. In previous tutorial we have already learned how to sort column data in ascending or descending order with pagination using Ajax in Laravel. In that application we have add one more feature like live table data search, because there are many viewers requested us to add live data search feature in Laravel sorting and pagination application. So here we have published video tutorial on Laravel framework by adding live MYSQL data search functionality in existing Laravel sorting with pagination application. So, in this part we will not discuss Laravel data sorting and pagination feature using Ajax, but we will add search functionality in existing code. For this we have go to pagination.blade.php file, and in this file we have to define text box for enter search query. So, here we have write input type is equal to text, name, and id is equal to search, user can search his or her query under this text box. Now we have moved to write jQuery code, so here in previous tutorial on Laravel sorting with pagination, we have already make one function for fetch data with sorting and pagination. Now we have modified this function, so this fetch data function has three argument, now here we have add one more query argument for search data. In this function we have use Ajax request for fetch data from MYSQL database using get data method. Option. So here in Ajax URL option, we have add query argument in URL get data method, so query value also pass to server for search data. Dollar. Below this function we have write dollar document with on method, under this method we have write key up event with text box id search, so when we have type something in text box, then this block of code will execute. Under this first we have write query variable is equal to dollar with text box id search with value method, this code will fetch value of search text box. Below this we have write column name variable is equal to dollar with hidden field id hidden column name with value method, this code fetch value of column name from this hidden field. After this we have write sort type variable is equal to dollar with hidden field id hidden sort type with value method, this code will fetch value of sorting type from this hidden field. For get current page number, we have write page variable is equal to dollar with hidden field id hidden page with value method. This method will return page number from this hidden field. Column. Once we have store query, column name, sorting type, and page details in local variable, now we have called fetch data function, and pass all variable value as argument. This function will return data according to search query, column sorting with pagination link without refresh of web page. Large, once data has been searched and their large number of data on web page, and we have to go next page of filter data, so we will click on pagination link. So here also we have to add query option and pass into fetch data function. Very, 
For this here we have write query variable is equal to dollar with text box id search with value method, this method will get value from this text box, and store under query variable. After getting query details, now we have passed this value into fetch data function, so here we have write query variable as fourth argument. Data. Same way we want to sort search data, so we have go to this jQuery block of code, this code is for sorting class. Here also we have write query variable is equal to dollar with text box id search with value method, this method will get value from this text box, and store under query variable. After getting query details, now we have passed this value into fetch data function, so here we have write query variable as fourth argument. Now we have go to pagination controller fetch data method, this method has received Ajax request for searching, sorting and data pagination, so here also we have to add data searching code. Here we have write dollar query variable is equal to dollar request variable with get method, under this method we have write query, here we have store search query details under this dollar query variable. Below this we have write dollar query variable is equal to string replace function with three argument like, blank space, percentage and dollar query variable space this function will replace blank space with percentage from given string here we can see php script for data sorting and pagination now here we have add where method with three argument like id column name like statement with dollar query variable this code will add where clause with like search query. Here we have add or where method with post title table column with like statement with dollar query variable. This method will add or operator for search data in post title table column. For search data in post description table column we have write or where method, and under this we have write post description table column with like statement with query variable. So this way we have add search data filter code in our existing code. Now this code will work for all three feature like data searching, data sorting, and data pagination. Now we have check output in browser. Friends here first we have refresh this page. After refresh of web page we can see on text box above tabular data for search data. And below this we can see data in table format with 20 pagination link. Here we want to search post related to array, so here we have type array in text box, after type of array in text box, below we can see table data has been changed, and display only that post in which array word is present. Below table we can see pagination has been reduced from 20 to 3, now we want to go to next page, so we have click on next page link. After click on next page link, then table data has been changed, here also it display post data in which array word is coming. So here live data search with pagination has been working in Laravel. Now we want to check live data search with column sorting is working or not, so here we want to sort the search filter data according to ID column sorting.
So here we have click on ID table column, after click on table column, whole table data has been sorted according value of ID, here we can see post data has been sorted with word come array. So we can see live data searching working with column sorting in ascending or descending order with pagination using Ajax. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query or input in comment box or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends or even you can also share on social media also. If you want to get more update regarding our video tutorial, please subscribe our YouTube channel for get more update regarding release of future video. Lastly keep watching our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.